Hi everyone, you are welcome to today's lesson. How are you? I wish I could move freely. The cameraman says I shouldn't move. Okay, today's lesson is a communication lesson. It's expressing regret. By the end of this lesson, we will be able to use regret expressions to talk about what? You remember? Issues related to citizenship, like last time. Now, read the following dialogue to answer the question. Where is the question? Here it is. Why didn't Jane participate in the donation party? Jack. Good morning, Jane. I hope you had enough rest after last week's event. Jane. I'm really sorry, I didn't participate in the donation party. Jack, why didn't you? You were so enthusiastic about it. Jane, I wish I hadn't lost control over my bike. I regret having gone to school by bike. If only I had gone to school by bus, I wouldn't have bumped into that car. Jack, I'm really sorry. I didn't know. If I had known, I could have visited you. Jane, it's all right, Jack. Never mind. I feel better now. Okay. Why didn't Jane participate in the donation party? Any idea? Jane didn't participate in the donation party because she had an accident. She bumped into a car. Now, when do we express regret? Or what is regret for? We express regret when we feel sad about having or not having done something. To express regret in English, we may use many different structures. What are they? Task two, read the dialogue again to underline, to underline the expressions of regret. Can you see them? Where are they? Yes? Great, I'm sorry. Why is she sorry? Because she didn't participate in the donation party. I wish I hadn't lost control over my bike. What's the problem here? She lost control over her bike. And she had an accident. So she wishes she hadn't lost control over her bike. Let's check our answers. So expression number one. I am really sorry. Number two, I wish. I regret. I regret having gone to school by bike. If only I had gone to school by bus. Look at the structure. Look at what follows the expression of regret. And the last one is I'm really sorry. And if I had known. If I had known. Does this remind you of anything? If? Okay. Now fill in the table with expressions of regret from the dialogue. Do you remember them? Okay, who can say? The first one is? Mm, I'm really sorry. Okay, let's check our answers. Expressions of regret are? I'm really sorry. I wish. I regret, if only, and condition number three, if, plus what we are going to see later. Now to express regret, we can use the following structures. Complete the following rule. Conditional type three, if plus what, plus what? Regret plus what? I wish or if only plus what? Do you remember from the text? 
I'm ready. Uh, I'm really. Ah, there is a mistake here. Sorry. I'm really sorry. And any other else structure? I should fix this mistake of I'm really sorry. Conditional type three. If plus past perfect plus would plus have plus past participle. Regret plus verb plus ing or regret plus having plus past participle or regret plus noun. I wish or if only plus past perfect. I'm really sorry. Again, this is amazing because I copied it. Huh? I'm really sorry plus subjects plus verb in the simple past. And the last one is should have plus past participle. Now express regrets in the following situations. Your neighbor phoned you to ask for help. When you arrived, he had already left. What are you going to say in this situation? If only I regret, I'm really sorry. Number two, your parents refused to let you participate in a visit that your school had organized to the hospital. Three, your classmates collected baby clothes and supplies to donate to new parents but you didn't participate. How are you going to express regret? Any idea? Okay, let's check our answers. I regret not having arrived before my neighbor left. I could have helped him. Two, if only I had participated in the visit our school had organized to the hospital. If, plus past, plus, plus, plus past perfect. If only I had participated. Number three, I should have participated in the donation act my classmates organized. Your turn to work now. Your neighbor organized a campaign where you did a lot of environmental acts, but you didn't participate. Write a list of the things you regret. If only I had, if only I hadn't, I regret having, etc., etc. Thanks, Inspector Ulbush, for helping in improving this lesson and thanks everybody for part for your attention goodbye